doing my hair is going to be a quick updo, but I'm going to be utilizing I'm going to be featuring these combs, combs as a demo. So I'm not sure. I haven't really thought out the plan as far as what I'm going to be doing for a style, but let's just see what happens. Now, just to let you know, I haven't. My hair's been twisted for like two weeks. It's due for a wash. So I will be washing it this weekend. And um, the last time I washed it, I did put that other product um, from Design Essentials, which I have not featured on my channel just yet. So the next time I wash, I hope to do a video so I can feature that product. But it's like a curling cream by Design Essentials. I like it, but it's just, um, it makes my hair a little bit stiff, stiffer than I want it to be. So I guess if I use a moisturizer with it, it should be okay. The first time I used it, I just put um, a leave-in. So it just needed something, I could tell my hair needed something a little bit extra, so I'm sure with the moisturizer it would feel so much better. So I have a lot of kink, cr crinkly kinks, so that's a good sign since it's been twisted for so long. And I was going to use these clips, I mean not really, they're not clips, they're hairpins. So I may just do it up to, it's rain, it's, well it's not rainy, but it looks like it's about to rain. Very dark and cloudy, gloomy, so I'm not sure. I'm probably just going to be wearing a hat anyway. But I figured I would just pop on here and do a quick video. I love using my new combs. They are bomb. You need to, <laughs> seriously, 4C. You need one of these. It's gentle on the hair and it really just glides through. It detangles the knots, like seriously, it does not leave your hair. It doesn't snag, let's put it that way. There's no snags and it just glides like butter through your hair. I didn't realize I had so many of these twists. Last time I had left these in, they were starting to really lock up. My hair is good for that. It's um, uh, if I leave my hair twisted too long, I may have some locks go going on. I'm not even sure if I want to comb it out because I like the way my hair is crinkly. Have a spot or not? I'll get a scissors for that. I do prefer to have my hair twisted. Back in the day I used to always have my hair in a two, uh, two, two strand twist out. Always wearing it out but it really, I can see a big difference since I've been wearing my hair and keeping it twisted. Or like when I used to wear braids all the time. That's another good protective style. My hair used to grow like crazy when I had um I'm not sure if I'm going to do an updo today. I may just pick this out. We're like a 
Fro. Okay, so, and once again, I am styling on pre, pre-washed hair <laughs> that needs to be washed, so bear with me. I have not used this pick yet. I like the shape of them because you can't see but the teeth they get they're chunky at the at the bottom at the foundation and as they go up they get narrow. I'm not sure if you can see that in the camera, but they get like kind of narrow as it, as you go. I just like the way it's designed. It's not like my other Pick has it's just the same the teeth is the same size all the way going all the way across probably would help if I had water but I don't have my water bottle up here it would make the process a lot smoother As you can see, my hairline is looking much, much better. It's still, you know, what can you say? I know when I comb it, you can see that it's a little bit fuller than it was. It's been pressed down, so see that? I don't know. It, it looks about the same to me, but maybe a little bit fuller than it was. I think this pick, I'm using it on dry hair. I think it works better with wet, when your hair is wet. Like if I had used my spray bottle, I believe, it just feels like a regular pick. I don't feel any difference. But when my when I did a wash and I used this comb and my hair was wet, it glide straight through. So I would recommend when you use this comb, this this pick or whether you get the, the comb of the pick, this is great for when your hair is wet. It's just my mistake that I don't have a water bottle up here today. I don't always think my videos all the way through before I click on this camera. So sometimes you just gotta roll with the punches. So oh. kind of want a messy look today because it is a rainy day and it's like like one of those days you just don't really care like to put a lot of effort <laughs> into your styling so I'm gonna twist it off to the side Thank you. 
get this out of here. I don't know if I'll need one, two, or three. I'm just going to kind of roll and tuck it. And then use one of these. Kind of hold it. You don't want it poking out the back. I may slide it up this way. and kind of work it the other way. Make it go this way. The phone is ringing. Not sure if that's going to work. Because it's not holding. And I put two. See, that ain't gonna hold. Okay, I'm just gonna split it down the middle. Doesn't have to be a clean part. Because I'm going to just roll and tuck. And then flip it. may have to use bobby pins. It's going to be a real, real quick rolling. <laughs> I don't have much time to play. I really have to learn how to use these hairpins because I'm not familiar with using them. They feel like they're going to slide out my hair. And it's looking very messy. So I'm going to take them out again. what you do when you in a crunch for now I don't have much time I'm just going to wear a handy headband push it back I 
right here in my eye. I really wanted to wear these today. I may have to come back on another day. I guess today is just not my day. It's not a very good hair day for me. I can't think of any styles, but I wanted to pop on real quick to show you and feature how these work. But this is featured on dry hair, so I'll do another video that where I feature on wet hair. So. Sorry about this video, but, um, you yeah, know, it is. I try to feature authentic videos, so whether they come out good or whether I struggle with my hair problems and hairstyles, you will see it. I am just going to keep on playing with it and make it a messy fro today. This is it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, thumbs up. Make sure that you, if you enjoy my, you can watch some more of my videos if you're not familiar. And you can hit that red button below the subscribe button if you would like to watch more videos and be subscribed so you don't miss the latest uploads. And make sure you hit that notification bell. That ensures that you will receive every video that I make. So on that note, enjoy your weekend, enjoy whatever time you're watching this morning, afternoon, evening, night, and we will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.